down, you fool. Do you want the blood fiends to see us? Now hush, hush! Medusa needs her ears right now. No, wait. Strike that. Let's talk. You can help, Medusa, yes? What kind of help? The helpful kind, of course. I meant to arrive before evil invaded this hamlet, find Constable Maldred, and provide what help I could. But this one was detained, and the constable is nowhere to be seen. Moira's hope is lost. Patience. Adusa will explain. The survivors, they are our priority. We move together to... No, no, too obvious. We move separately, draw less attention that way. Adusa noticed a few survivors headed toward the large barn in the distance. Meet me there. You go first, then Adusa shall sneak off. Less chance of both of us getting captured by these cursed creatures that way. If you must, but hurry, please. Survivors have a terrible habit of becoming dead when they are left unattended. Not is, was. This was the peaceful hamlet of Moira's hope. Now? Now it is a disaster area. Must Adusa explain everything? Look around. The people of Moira's hope were either turned into blood fiends or turned into food for blood fiends. Now, as to the who and the why of this horror, Adusa cannot say. Someone who wishes she had arrived in time to divert this tragedy. But if wishes were fishes, Adusa would be a very happy cat. This one is here to help. Now please, the survivors need us. I'll be just a step behind you.
I'll stick you with this sword. I mean it. Calm down, Shapeskin. Your courage is commendable, but highly misplaced. We are here to help. What do you think you'll make with that? Stay back, vampire! I'll stick you with this sword. I mean it. Calm down, Shapeskin. Your courage is commendable, but highly misplaced. We are here to help. And how am I supposed to trust you? This one could have overwhelmed you at any time. Now stand down. Paradusa will stick that sword where the bright moons never shine. What? How dare you? Okay. I'll just go and sit down. Mortals, show a little concern, and this is the thanks you get. And where is the constable? Why isn't he here? But that is a mystery for another time. The survivors are our priority. Still, these vampires, they are most unusual. Precision, such coordination. Rarely have I seen vampires behave like an army instead of raiders. This wasn't an incursion. It was an occupation. We must work quickly. It won't take long for the enemy to discover our presence. You stay here and guard these townsfolk. I'll go search for more survivors. No, no! Reverse that. Better for you to search and Adusa to stay here. Watch for signs of the constable. I will try to learn more about our enemy while you are gone. You ask many questions, like a young one who has eaten too much moon sugar. Constable Maldred is a friend, a trusted contact. We have worked together in the past. And speaking of work, don't you have some survivors to save? That is what I am, yes? Surely you have learned by now that not every vampire is a monster. Adusa hopes that this doesn't make you uncomfortable. We still have survivors that need our assistance.
try and save me. Please, I'll join your army. Really, I will. Just don't kill me. Oh, you're not one of them, are you? Thank the divines. They just marched into town like they owned the place. That cold, horrible woman. She whispered something to the soldier, and people began to change. The woman made a strange gesture, and townsfolk began turning into blood fiends. And she just walked away and let her companions... They were so fast, so strong. They, they started tearing people apart. Anyone who didn't change was attacked. Other survivors? I did dare hope. All right, lead the way. Take me to the barn. Come on, let's have at it. I'd rather die fighting than get turned into one of your pitiful creatures. Well, that's a relief. I thought for sure you were going to kill me. I just wish you had gotten here in time to save my father. They called her Lorea. She demanded that we line up to receive her blessing. That's what she called it, her blessing. My father was one of the first to step forward and tell her what to do with her blessing. She ripped out his throat. You're right, I know you're right. Lead the way.
was your kind. Come any closer and this goes straight into your heart. I'm perfectly safe right where I am. Thank you very much. I've got a sharp blade and plenty of food. I'm downright cozy. But those bloodsuckers turn the townsfolk into their feral pets. Absolutely depressing. Divines take them all. survivors? Why didn't you say so? I'll follow you, but we need to be very careful. These creatures aren't like any vampires I ever read or heard stories about. They're like a divine's damned army. Never mind then. <laughs> well, you are gone. We had a few visitors. Nothing Adusa couldn't handle, of course, but we shouldn't linger in this place much longer. Yes, Adusa noticed. Fewer than I hoped, but more than I expected. Meanwhile, this one learned that the vampires left a commander here. He's up in the house, atop the hill. Moira's hope can never recover while he controls the town. Militant vampires require structure. Why is that so surprising? But we have more pressing matters. I will get the survivors out of town. You must deal with the vampire commander. Meet us on the road when the deed is done.
great area for harvesting.
They made their choices. So be it. By the look on your face, Adusa assumes you were successful? The Vampire Commander is dead, yes? Maldred? That's the name of the... No. That unclawed traitor! Adusa only wishes she had been the one to end him. You did well, Five Claw. Adusa will see that these people reach a safe haven. Then I have business of my own to attend to. Inspire Five Claw. Keep your wits about you and stay fragrant. What you saw here is only the beginning. Adusa will take the survivors to Horfrost Downs. They should be safe enough there. Pardon, but this one is still coming to grips with how fast the blood fiends were created and with the constable's betrayal. Typically, a vampire degenerates over time, eventually withering into a mindless blood fiend. The process we observed in Moira's Hope was quite the opposite. The blood curse appeared to change its victims into blood fiends almost immediately. Yes, word of what happened here must be carried to my master, Count Verandis. There is much work to be done. And very little time if Lorea has truly ventured this far south.
your trading here. Welcome to the Bank of Daggerfall. Bank of Daggerfall. Welcome to the Bank of Daggerfall. Welcome to the Bank of Daggerfall. 